Man, it has been way too many years. So that's where it comes from. I guess we know which side of the family I take my green creative side after. See, just an hour before this, I said, Tengo más hambre que un león. <laughs> I have no idea. I was already recording. <laughs> You see this? It's the result of me on a plane. I'm back. So, after a four and a half hour long flight from home to Guadalajara, finally made it here. I'm at my grandma's house. And, man, I am rocking my Spanish. And turns out, introductions were a lot easier than I thought. I mean, ever since, uh, ever since I went to Los Angeles, I've changed. And the last time I went here, I was, I was just a naive sophomore. From Milwaukee. Now I'm just a graduate from Milwaukee. Who could really use a nap? And it's only like 10.53 in the morning. But uh, other than that... I'd say life here is pretty easy going. Oh, I uh, forgot to mention a few things. Um, they wanted me to hold my little niece, which is only a few months old, and I have no experience with holding babies. So I just asked everyone if they wanted to take selfies. This. It's me talking to you with my mind. And time warp. Man, I am rocking this hot new look. <sighs> Smells like Mexico. <laughs> and looks like Brooklyn. Or Jersey. I don't know. I've never been to New York. Am I in Mexico or France? Will somebody tell me? Seriously, will someone clear it up for me? Well, this is a familiar sight. the epic here and it's about it's 618 and so far today I've driven through Guadalajara at night visited my grandma and several other of my relatives several of my other relatives that's what I meant Seriously, I can't even speak perfect English. <laughs> and I spent six hours there getting... Mostly catching up on some overdue sleep. Because when 
You stay up all night trying to travel across a country, and you spend your time writing a, a few song lyrics that tends to give you some Z's. Anyway, um, in case you don't know, um, this is the same room I shot my very first videos in two years ago, but I never posted them to the internet. Until now, of course, because what's the point of making a video if no one's going to see it? Oh, great. Marty McFly should have told that to his dad in Back to the Future. Um, no more spoilers. I just told you the name of the main character. That's all. And which direction in time, time warp. travels to? <laughs> I've got to start... I've got to stop yapping. Okay, obviously I'm, I don't have that much to say. Other than my cousin's kids have grown up, um, I've grown more, and they actually consider 60 degrees here cold. While back home in Portland, it's 32 degrees right now. And the ice is still there. And people are still asking me to make a frost point video. Well, <sighs> newsflash, this is what you're getting. Adventuras in Mexico. <sighs> okay, well. While I try and figure out how to survive here, you guys are gonna skip ahead in time. Man, this is shaky. Earthquake! Last time I was here, I nearly got addicted to Coca-Cola. Gotta keep my health up. Would you believe I got this from Mexico City six years ago? <sighs> Just couldn't help but bring it back. Okay, you want me to describe today in two words? Here they are. Hakuna Matata means no worries. Okay, uh, today's been sort of easy going. Uh, my dad found a punctured nail in his tire. So, he and my cousin Carlos went to get it fixed, and they were gone for hours. Which took me a while to get this. This little flash drive here is my time machine. <laughs> and a few other things like... The movies that we bought, Maze Runner, hmm. Captain America, <laughs> you probably already guessed that, Lord of the Rings, <laughs> okay honestly I've got nothing else to say. Aw, oh, this is so cute. <laughs> wow, I should have done this a long time ago. But then again, I didn't have this tripod until a few days ago. Which was Christmas.
makes things easier. Thank you very much. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna sneak up to that room and we're gonna take a little something back. Anyone here sleeping there? Sorry, I just needed a bit of excitement because, let's face it, just me talking, not enough. Anyway, I think I've had a better first day in Guadalajara than I've ever had in my life. Like I keep on saying, um, I changed as over a year ago. For example, I didn't have this to deal with. Or not much of these. Okay, let me describe to you what I've seen so far. A bunch of graffiti, <laughs> one of which was Baby Muhammad Ali. And what else? Oh yeah, um, some adult TV version of The Hobbit. What else? So much Chicago or Detroit or New York style. So, a lot of trash. But, I've asked, I've asked my relatives and they say everything is totally easy going. Let's hope it stays that way. We're out of beds, and best I got is this couch. And it effed up my back that night. Okay. Well, I'll try to make the most out of the next few days. Well, that's a wrap for day one.